Danny gang <laughs> welcome back to our channel so y'all y'all today is still Wednesday so the last vlog that you saw where we got up and went ahead and hit the gym at 5 in the morning it's still that day um I'm just now showered dressed and like back out we did I did go home and I showered and did everything I would say that I and I did everything that I said I was going to do in the last vlog. So make sure that y'all um, check that out. But yeah, um, so now it's like almost 12 o'clock and I'm headed outside. Y'all, I am, sorry y'all shaking. I am on the hunt for these freaking espresso shots in a can. Like, I, like that's all I'm thinking about y'all. Like I literally want to find them so bad that even though I don't feel good I'm out in these North Carolina streets trying to find them um, I know a couple of you guys are telling me that you guys get them from Target so basically at this point I'll even pick up a couple of the individual cans but I was looking for like the 4 or the 12 pack so that was like my goal that I am now accepting new members of the Danny Gang. So if you want to be a member of the game because you're keto, because you like books, or because you just want to support me, then like, comment, subscribe, hit the bell, and pitch your fist up. You got to fight me, y'all, because 2020 is ghetto, and I need people on my game that's going to hold it down. So like, comment, subscribe, put your fist up, and fight me. And once you're jumped in, and only then will you become a lifetime member. Period. So yeah, y'all, um, I'm just out here about to hit like a couple Starbucks and a couple Targets to see if I can find any. Um, not rocking any makeup today. I'm just literally not in the mood like at all for any kind of makeup. Um, I'm still using this Dollar Tree lip balm. Smells so good, feels so good. So yeah. Y'all, getting up this morning felt so freaking good. Like, I felt so rejuvenated um, by getting up this morning. Y'all know I used to get up in the, and go to the gym at 4 a.m. all the time. But um, ever since COVID hit, I haven't been, obviously, because the gym was closed. And then I wasn't able to get back in that stride. But, y'all, today, I definitely did. And it felt so good. So, I'm super excited to like continue to get up at four and just hit the gym. Um, thank y'all for all the love that I am receiving on my Instagram name change. So I did change the name of, excuse me, I did change the name of my fitness Instagram um, to, it was Fit Girl Danny J. Now I changed it to A Healthier Danny. I just think that that fits really well. And if you want to know exactly why I changed my Instagram name and see more information like on um, before and after pics, because I am back posting on that page, then go ahead and head over to Instagram and head over to A Healthier Danny. This vlog is probably going to be today, which is Wednesday, and tomorrow, which is Thursday, so that I can have something to post Friday. And then y'all probably won't see another vlog after Friday until Monday because it's going to be a lituation. It's going to be a real lit weekend. So I'm not going to try to break my back to post. Just know when I do post, the post is going to be lit. And I'm also working on making my videos longer. So, yeah. Y'all have been liking that too. But anyway, this is a five minute intro. So I'll see y'all in Target. This is what I'm wearing. All right, gang. So I ran in Target and I got a couple things. Mm. I may show y'all what I got at Target, but basically, let me see. I didn't really get nothing worth showing. I did find another Premier Protein in, uh, Cafe Latte. So basically what I'm doing is when I see them, I just buy them and I'm just putting them in my um, trunk so that I can go ahead and take them home. Um, and then I found just some other things that I needed, but I cannot find the Starbucks. Um, I cannot find the Starbucks Espresso. So I bought something else. I'll show y'all that when I go home. But y'all, I stopped at Aldi. And I followed this girl, her name is C My Keto on Instagram, and she had posted these candles. Y'all, these candles smell 
exactly. They even better than the Walmart ones I showed y'all. These smell exactly like Bath and Body Works and they're $3.99 opposed to I think the $4.99 or $5.99 ones at Walmart and they're by Huntington Home. This one's Sweet Peach, Calypso Sands. I said, well, let me just go. I said, I said, well, let me just go see, sis. I'm like, let me go check on the bread. Y'all, I found the red zero net carb wheat bread. I didn't find one. I ain't found two. I found three. I found three of the zero net carb wheat breads. Five um, grams of protein, nine grams of fiber, zero net carbs. <laughs> zero guilt so i got three of these um i have yet to found these in atlanta so i got three of them um i'm going home on friday so they they'll be good um if i have to i'll throw them in base freezer just so they can freeze until i make it home but they should be okay but yeah y'all i'm super juiced because y'all said that the orange one was good which it is but y'all said that this was the best this was y'all favorite so i just wrapped up yeah y'all i will see y'all when i get home all right, y'all, so I made it back, and I told y'all I was going to come show y'all um, some stuff that I found at Target. So I found two of these sparkling water drinks. So I never had um, sparkling water from Target, I don't think, but I saw these, and I picked them up. I got peach mango, and I got Fuji apple just to hold me over for the next couple days. Um, and then household items, just got that toothpaste and then got these glade plug-ins um just to refill the ones that i have here currently in sheer vanilla embrace and then lastly i picked up this pete's black and white true iced espresso and it has 13 grams of carbs y'all that is a lot um but i still picked it up i want to try it just to see um one of my loyal 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 subscribers just sent me a, a link to where i can get some espresso so i'm gonna check that out and see if it's legit but yeah that's what i picked up from target and then i already showed y'all the candles that i got from aldi um y'all they smell so good so y'all should definitely see if y'all can find them and um yeah that's all that i got I'm about to just chill, and I'll see you guys later. All right, guys. So, yeah, now I am sitting on the patio, and I kind of do this um, most mornings. I'll come out here and sit on the patio while Babe um, kind of just, like, sits in there and eats breakfast and, you know, does what he does. But I like to come out here and play a little bit of Animal Crossing. So, right now, I just have Animal Crossing and Mario Kart 8. Um, I've been addicted to Animal Crossing um but yeah this is my switch in the coral color i absolutely love it i have my coffee right here and i put it in this ninja cup so that you guys can see Um, if y'all play Animal Crossing, let me know. I am literally addicted. I haven't been able to play much here because, you know, obviously I'm with Babe, so I'm not spending much time with him. But yeah, I'm. St I don't have my house house yet. I moved out of my tent, so I have my house. But I'm trying to get um, this house. So I just have to um, pay off my current house and then I can upgrade. So yeah. So yeah, y'all, I'm just about to sit here, play a little bit of Animal Crossing, enjoy my morning, and I'll see you guys a little later. Good morning, officially Danny Gang. So yeah, in the previous clips, y'all saw me chilling, relaxing, maxing all cool. 
Nah, but y'all saw me chilling. I made coffee this morning and I had coffee, so I, I got energy, y'all. And then I played Animal Crossing for a little while. Um, I had to wash and fold my clothes, so I did that. Now I'm out, y'all. I'm about to go hit the gym. It's like 11.37 and I'm gonna go to the gym because tonight is my last night in North Carolina. So I'm sure I'm gonna wanna eat something that's not good for me, I think. Uh, I'm not even hungry. I ate a lot yesterday. And if you know me, and if you watch me, then you know in my wedding, I eat in the days. I don't eat that much because I'm just naturally not a hungry person anymore like after i lost all that weight like i stopped being so hungry all the time and a lot of times when i was bigger i wasn't even hungry y'all i was just eating because i was bored or i didn't have nothing to do so yeah but now um i literally only eat when i'm hungry so I, I, i'm not naturally hungry but yesterday i ate a lot like you know i wasn't like eating bad food but i just ate a lot um ate fruit um had breakfast a dinner so yeah natural you naturally I don't eat breakfast I drink coffee but yesterday I skipped coffee and we had breakfast so yeah all good all good it's Thursday I feel really good though because um last night me and baby had Bible study get y'all a man that pray and want to do Bible study and it was actually his idea period so that was amazing um so we had Bible study, um, and we ate dinner, we watched a movie, and then we ended up, you know, going to sleep or whatever. So, yeah, woke up today feeling rejuvenated, and we didn't get up and go to the gym at 4 a.m., so I'm going now. I don't know what time baby's going to go or if he's going to go today. Today might be his off day. Don't know, but y'all, even when you get in relationships, if you got goals, you got to keep your goals. So, I know I need to go to the gym. I know I need to walk. And I also know I might want to eat something not so good for me. So I'm going to go to the gym. Make sure you keep your goals, y'all. Because we can quickly, quickly, quickly get in relationships and want to eat, drink, forget about our goals, forget about our own self. But you got to stay, you got to stay focused, y'all. And I struggle with that myself. Let's not, let's not get it twisted like I'm, you know, I'm saying for myself too, so. I'm holding myself accountable and especially I love the Danny game because I know, you know, y'all watch my vlogs and um, me vlogging is holding myself accountable. So I just got a Powerade, a Zero and a Mixed Berry. This is all I have left. So I'm probably about to kill this before I get to the gym. Um, and then after we leave the gym, y'all, I have to go pick up some birthday gifts. So Ulta, Sephora, you know, all these places emailed me and was like, sis, come get your birthday gift. So sis, I'm coming. So after that, I'm gonna go get my birthday gifts from um, all the stores that have emailed me and told me to come pick them up. And um, we need a case of water. And just, I'm just about to be out running some errands or whatever because your girl got things to do. So yeah, I just wanted to come and let y'all officially see my face. Um, Y'all, this flavor is so good, ice cold. And I'm drinking it because I know I'm gonna work up a sweat in the gym and stuff, so I'm just go ahead and get some um, electrolytes. But yeah, y'all, happy Thursday. How's y'all day? Y'all know I'm getting a little sad because I leave tomorrow. I'm gonna miss my man or whatever. But as y'all know, I'll be right back. I don't know when I'm coming back. We haven't discussed it yet, but I'm sure tonight we will and that's another tip that i gave in my q a if y'all are like in a long distance relationship or whatever y'all should definitely always talk about the next time you're gonna see each other um before you officially leave because it can get kind of um nerve-wracking if you don't know the next time you're gonna see your partner especially if you know y'all live more than an hour or two away um i think five hours and more is like officially long distance um i know some people say an hour is long distance but i mean living in atlanta you an hour is really nothing so i think like five hours and up turns into long distance so yeah always discuss the next time you're gonna see your partner before whoever's leaving leaves but yeah let me get to the gym and i'll pull y'all back out i may do a little bit of my workout with y'all um so yeah 
See y'all in a second. Done with my workout. I did 2.3 miles on the treadmill. Um, took me a little longer than usual because I don't feel well cramping, but still came and got it in. I kind of feel like now that I've done well with my workout, I can like do a little shopping and reward myself with maybe a good dinner. So, yeah. Let us get in the car and head to the next spot. My birthday, y'all. My birthday was like a week ago and I'm still getting gifts. Um, I don't know if there's a Sephora around here, so I may not be able to go get that one, but got my Ulta birthday gift, yay. All right, y'all, so I just left Ulta. Y'all, before I even show y'all what I got from Ulta, I just want y'all to know that I am so very grateful. Like, I got two emails back-to-back -back with sponsorships and an email before I left on my birthday trip. So that's three emails this month with sponsorships that I have been manifesting since I started doing YouTube and I am just so excited. Of course, I'm not going to tell you guys what the sponsorships are now, but you guys will see them and hopefully when y'all see them like in upcoming videos, y'all will support me um because I'm just super excited and super blessed and just thank y'all so much for subscribing because I'm getting sponsorships that I absolutely never thought I would get. So yeah, I'm super excited and happy. But yeah, got my birthday gift. I thought I would show you guys real quick. So, this month i don't know if everybody got this who had a birthday this month but i got the um nars blush in orgasm x such cute pa packaging um y'all know i'm not like a real makeup snob or whatever but i mean it's my birthday you want to give me a gift so thank you but yeah so packaging is super cute black and pink and when you open it up it's like right here let's go ahead and pop it out i just want to show y'all real quick because i love opening up birthday gifts so it's really cute 
I don't really know how to like incorporate blush and stuff. I don't do a lot of makeup looks. Y'all know I'm super plain Jane when it comes to makeup. Uh, I am learning and I want to learn more. But yeah, this is what it looks like. Absolutely gorgeous. This is the color. And like I said, this is Orgasm X and it is the NARS cute little palette. Absolutely love. And on the inside, it says there's a sex appeal and there's X appeal. Introducing new Orgasm X. So super cute y'all i like how i had this little band on it that says orgasm x honey so cute so yeah i'm just gonna put this on um i also need to get um a case of water i think i'm gonna have a caesar salad when i get home it's like 1 30 so yeah i'm getting a little hungry but not really because i ate so much yesterday so yeah a little birthday gift cute and they had it in this bag. I'm just super excited to get home and sit down and respond to comments. And I know I don't tell you guys like a lot of the time when I'm like doing business, but every day I check my emails, I respond to comments, I respond to emails, not a particular time of day, but every day I carve out like a little time to like respond to you guys and respond to companies that may have reached out to me. So I'm gonna do that when I get back home. When companies reach out to me, companies in general, and especially companies I really wanna work with, I respond to them like right away um just because i check my email so often in order to be able to do that and um, when people offer partnerships sponsorships um campaigns i like to just be at the forefront of them i answer all my emails um i do all the negotiating myself so yeah i'm just super excited and I'm happy because there's a Harris Teeter right here in the shopping center. So I'm going to run a Harris Teeter, get a case of water. I'm just trying to see what else stores they got around here. I kind of want to like surprise baby and take him out to dinner for like my last night since he treated me so well throughout my whole birthday week. But yeah, as I was saying, I kind of want to take um, baby out to dinner tonight. Like a little surprise, like get dressed, we going out to eat. I don't know, we'll see since it's like my last night and he like he was amazing. Like my birthday trip has been one for the books. Um, so I kind of want to take him out to eat. So I might do that just to like thank him and you know, show him he's still special, even though it's my birthday. But yeah, y'all, let's go in the grocery store so that I can go home and um, either make a salad or I might have some watermelon. No, watermelon is not the most keto, but that's kind of what I have a taste for. So, uh, yeah, let's go in here. All right, y'all, so this is basically all I'm going to get out of here. Um, I got a 24-pack to put in the fridge and then a 35-pack to just put in his closet because, y'all, he drink hella water. So, um, since I'm out, I'm just going to get these two cases so he'll be straight when I leave, you know, take care of my man. But, y'all, I also see that this store, Harris Teeter, sells the Sola bread. So, I have never been able to find this bread in Atlanta y'all i haven't been able to find this bread in atlanta so if you're keto i know you've seen this solar bread like um online and stuff like that um and like on instagram and like i was gonna buy this bread hella times but i just didn't i'm not gonna get this bread because i actually got the bread from aldi but yeah they have this solar bread which is four net carbs a slice uh, deliciously seeded 70 calories 5 grams of protein per slice per slice and then they also have this other bread golden wheat three net carbs per slice 60 calories and five protein so i'm gonna stick with my aldi bread because it's zero net carbs but i was shocked like literally shook when i saw that they carried this like so much stuff in North Carolina I cannot get in Atlanta but anyway I just wanted to show y'all so if y'all have like a Harris Teeter and been looking for like low carb bread then try Harris Teeter in the frozen section like with the frozen bread so yeah I'm not gonna get it but now at least I know where it is if I'm out here and I can't find any at all these so all right just want to show y'all that I'm really 
right, gang, so I'm going to go ahead and end the vlog here. If I end up do going out to eat, I may pick up the camera and start off a new vlog with that. But, again, it's my last day in North Carolina. So, y'all already know I want to just chill, relax, um, rest from my drive home, and spend time with the babe. So, yeah, y'all, the last couple scenes, y'all just saw me kind of like speed cleaning. Y'all, I love to clean. I tell y'all that all the time. So, yeah, I just always speed clean. I mean, while I always just clean, I sped it up for y'all because... I ain't want it to be too boring. But yeah, guys, I love y'all. Uh, hopefully, y'all loved this video. Thank y'all so much for rocking with me. Again, thank y'all for all the love on my last vlog in the comments saying that I am not boring and sis was tripping, period. But yeah, if you made it all the way to the end of the video, go ahead and drop the little pen and paper down below because y'all, we getting sponsorships. Y'all, we signing contracts and I'm so excited. Um, The next time y'all see me, most likely, I'll be back in Atlanta. So yeah, wish me traveling grace in the comments and yeah, happy Friday because when you guys are seeing this it's friday and i'm probably on the road so i love y'all i'll see you guys on my next video reporting live from the internet signing out back to you world